Welcome to another episode of Wonders of the World Wide Web. In this episode, we're going to talk about Crayon. But what is Crayon? Crayon is software that can generate drawings based on your text input. But how does it work? The people of Crayon programmed a powerful computer and turned it into a self-learning machine. They gave the computer so many examples of drawings and text that the computer learned to read and draw. After installing Crayon, you can communicate with the Crayon supercomputer via the telephone line. The computer will analyze your text, create an image, and send it to your computer. For Crayon, you'll need a PC, a hard disk drive, a modem, also known as modulator demodulator, a Crayon subscription, and the Crayon installation diskette. Installing the software is easy. Run setup period exe and go through the installation process. Done! Let's try it. We start the executable file crayon by typing crayon. Press a random key to continue. Okay, now we see a text field. What do you want to generate? What about a landscape? Now the software connects to a supercomputer. It will send our assignment to the supercomputers of Crayon. They will analyze our assignment and give us feedback after five minutes. We've received an answer Generating this image will take around four hours. Disconnected. The software disconnected the modem so you can make calls again. We see a timer on the screen. You can close Crayon and use your computer for other things. In four hours, we're going to start Crayon again. Ah, it's time to start Crayon again. You requested an image of a landscape. Do you want to download this image? Sure. Done. Let's view the image by pressing the return key. Oh, wow. Believe it or not, this landscape was drawn by an artificial intelligent computer. Isn't that great? Let's try another drawing. Now I'm going to make it a little harder for the computer. I want an image of a banana with a funny face. Oh wow, this one takes eight hours to generate. Tomorrow we can see if it worked. Let's see what Crayon made for us. That looks awesome. We surely live in the future. Let's make it a little bit more difficult for Crayon. I want Crayon to generate an artwork in the style of a Dutch painter that portrays the feelings of abandonment experienced by a middle-aged historian afflicted with various phobias. This one will take an estimated 48 hours to generate. What an awesome week we've had. Let's see what Crayon made for us. Wow, exactly what I requested. I love modern art. Here are some more things we created, just to give you an indication of what Crayon is capable of. Because not everybody has a powerful graphics adapter, Crayon can also generate art in text mode. This is often faster and still impressive. If you want to start Crayon in text mode, press F5 before you request a drawing. Let's request a drawing of a landscape in the style of Bob Ross. Wow! 
Look at this. Wow. We showed you several examples of images that looked exactly what I hoped for, but sometimes it goes wrong. We requested Crayon, for instance, to generate an image of a baseball player holding a bat. This was the result. Here are some other creations Crayon generated in text mode. I can't believe that this is real. Crayon is currently working on an update that can also generate realistic images, photos. This software is not available yet, but for our show, Crayon was nice enough to generate a photo of the president as a Star Trek character. Wow, look at this! What will the future of artificial intelligence bring us? Self-driving cars? Software that will do your homework for you? <laughs> Probably not, but never say never. For now, we can't wait to generate more computer-generated images online.